uh, good morning, uh, everybody. Good morning, Kwang. And uh, uh, today we have a professor from National Chi University in Taiwan, Professor Kuo Hung Wang. Uh, he uh, is professor at the Department of E-Learning Design and Management at Mentioned University. And uh, he uh, just uh, he has a visit, uh, let's say, traditional, I would say, visit in Lithuania, in particular in Shoulei, and uh, he's going to take part also in our national conference this week. Um, okay, please, Wang, start uh, your presentation, a little bit secret presentation, because, uh, you know, you mentioned only title, topic, but, but not uh, not about content. Uh, okay, okay, so I'll show you uh, PowerPoint first, then I will show some uh so real activities uh then then probably we going to try some uh, uh irs system some apps we use uh, a lot in, in classroom so maybe later you prepare your uh, your phone then we can come we have some online test uh we are trying to test so you can see how it's like we use in classroom, um, and then we are I'll discuss about the uh, the pros and cons of the, this topic. Okay, so first I'll show you my PowerPoint. Okay, can you see this one? Oh uh, yes. Let me see. Okay. Okay. So. Uh -oh. Okay, PowerPoint disappeared. So you can see this one? Not yet. No? Once, ag once again, please try once again. Oh, okay. It's okay? Uh, no, it's okay, They're just in full mode. Okay, just, just leave it here. So I just uh, I, I play the, the uh, PowerPoint, it could be some problem. Ah, so okay. you can see that you can see that this one okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay so um, my topic is one tablet per student initiative in taiwan so this um, uh, is a new um, project uh, a national project so uh, i'm going to talk about this new project then we have some initial um result but but i Mm, uh, uh, we'll, you can you can express your opinions after my introduction. Okay, so um, the first uh, I will intro introduce the product the initiative, then some platform and apps. Um, then we will we'll show you some real activity. Okay, so the first part introduction. Okay. Um, and now talk about the big one uh, from 2014 to 2021. Uh, there's a, a mobile learning experimental project in Taiwan. Uh, actually, this uh, is a button up uh, project. So the Ministry of Education uh, invites all the uh, elementary schools and secondary school uh, to apply for a grant. So it's granted the school will be provided with um, uh, tablets and some funding for the school to uh, explain uh, some types of uh, teaching experiments to uh, integrate uh, the tablet in the classroom. Okay, then, then from uh, 2020 to 2025, okay, this is a, a national project. Okay, so every school has to join this project. So there's a uh, four years project. Okay, so actually this is a, a very a big uh, project that is a lot of money. So actually not every uh, professors or some teachers agree with this initiative because it's too large so it's uh 
occupy a lot of funding for education. So uh, it's, it's, but right now it's, it's, it's ongoing now. So we're going to see what's happened. Then uh, we can see the, the result if it's okay. Um, all the money will go to um, four areas. First one is content design. So uh, the government will uh, outsource uh, the e-learning production to companies and to uh, teachers. So actually not teachers, some volunteer team, not volunteer, some professional teams. So for teachers, they don't need to design any uh, learning materials. They just use. So let the company and, and professional teams to design all the e-learning materials according to the textbook. So this we spend a lot of money for the for company design. Then the second one, the Wi-Fi environment. Each classroom will be equipped at high speed Wi-Fi. And then, then the, the most uh, money goes to the tablet purchase. So the quantity of, will be for some rural area school. Each student has one tablet. For school in the city, uh, every six students have one tablet because it's, it's, a, it's a, there are many students, so they can share. Not you, you, so this there will be enough. Okay, um, then the school can decide what kind of tablet will they will purchase. Some school will buy iPad. Some will use some. Uh, 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 some Galaxy, Samsung Galaxy, some use in ASUS. So, okay, it's, it's up to the schools. And then uh, to evaluate the fairness of this uh, project, so there's a, a research team to analyze the, the, the fairness, if it's, it's good or not, okay. Uh, so this is the background of this project. So now uh, probably you can see uh, in Taiwan, many uh, students from primary school to high school, they all use uh, tablet or, uh, in classroom. Okay. Then here I will show you some real activity. So I actually have five activities showing the real activities. So the first one will be some tablet management because uh, in addition to the tablets, uh, the school needs to some equipment to charge uh, and to store. Um, then explain some t teachers teaching uh, with uh, this tablet. Then some other ways to use this uh, tablet integrating with your uh, teaching. So there's a problem solving and presentation uh, activity. So actually then for teachers, we have provided many workshops or some training uh, session encouraging teachers to use the, the tablet in their classroom. So we have some online uh, uh, demonstration that teacher can open, openly uh, share their teaching the next one, there's a one the physical education teacher use the tablet. So I put a question mark here. And I think it's if you, you can judge if it's okay or not. Okay. So now I'm going to switch to to the one. I'm going to switch to the. Okay, can you see the, this this one? Oh yes, I, it seems okay. Uh, just without audio, because possible when sharing, you need to indicate to include computer sound. Okay, so probably I I just 
I just use uh, you don't need a sum. Okay, so probably just I'll, I'll just explain. So in each classroom, there's so there's this kind of a machine. So student uh, the the store all the tablet inside. So they put in charge. So that then this so student every student at, at the beginning of a, a, a day they were just to uh, take it out then to uh, borrow this this one so they can use the one by one so they they actually using in the classroom okay this one uh, so they have to the management. So this, this video will show uh, about how teachers uh, use it in the classroom. Actually, there's some traditional workshop that is uh, still in use. We don't replace everything with computers. We use uh, traditional paper, uh, some workshop, some assignment, but we use uh, combined with uh, uh, tablet. Okay. So, uh, this is okay. We can show some. Okay, this is uh, this some uh, uh, this school. This called the proportion. Okay, there's one half, the, the one fourth. So, so this is the uh, test, the quiz, the a student, all kind of um, the ratio. Okay, the little one, there's, they will show some flag. Okay, what proportion of red colors in the, this red? In this answer, there will, will be half. Okay, the next one is Thailand. And then this one, red colors, is what proportion is probably is the two of six, so one third. And let's check. It's quite uh, not easy to guess the red color. Okay, this red color is wobby wobby. So the teacher just demonstrate you have to cut into triangles. So how many triangles here? So you can guess the, the ratio of the, the red color. Okay. So then this one there will be a uh, Okay, the eye on on this eye is later you everyone has to do this, I show you. Actually after teachers teach the mathematics and immediately they have a, a quiz. So students has to use their uh, tablet to answer. So they have been 20 seconds. Uh, to log in. Okay, then test start. Okay. So every student can use their tablet. This is, this is the first one. So there's every student has to use their tablet uh, to see the and okay then to select the answer into input their answer into the, the uh, then the teachers know the career rate right away okay then okay then there's some uh, traditional uh, teaching they use the uh, worksheet okay okay so they have used the scissors and pass so then this one is uh, where they introduce later. There are some uh, online examinations. So they provide free reviews by the Ministry of Education. So students can later to continue to work some extra uh, practice question as their homework. Uh, okay. All right, okay, this and then there's some students to share what to solve a problem. 
so they share their real discussion then they'll work on the worksheet okay okay so how to cut this one then how to decide the ratio okay all right this is the uh, one sample okay then the, this this one is also use uh, um they encourage the student to work together as a group so and they will use traditional uh some worksheet and combine with the, the tablet okay okay yes different uh, there's a, a question but have different kind of solutions so uh, see them will work in groups to find uh, how to solve the problems. Okay, then. Okay, let's touch in the worksheet. So, they will uh, do the work, then take a picture uh, with their template, then share their solution uh, with other groups. Okay, so there is a uh, present their solutions okay then after that then these teachers will uh, talk about the every group's uh, solutions then uh, there are different kinds of solutions so they just uh, have some feedback about students uh, solutions okay um, then the student can come out to, to have some other different solution they can come up to, to share. Okay, so. Okay, then this is a presentation. Okay, then this. Then this one is a. Uh, Okay, this is each issue. Then we'll you see, log in with your your tablet. The, per, the teacher will know uh, which student is is, is is here. Then there's a, a, ser a series of workshop by uh, teachers. They just demonstrate teaching. Then and also these teachings is broadcast online. So others, teachers can learn uh, from uh, these teachers. So, okay, so there's some camera here. So, so there's some camera back. Okay, so this is, actually this use, this kind of is, is use the, the Kahoo we will, we will try later. So there's, they can know students with uh, feedback. Okay. So also they provide some group works. You can uh, to solve a problem. Um, then this is the random number. The system will select one student to answer. Okay. Okay. Also, you can see this. That then, then this after discussion, they can they can just send it with their tablet to the the teachers. So teacher will receive all the uh, their uh, work. Uh, so they can share. Okay. This one, this student just uh, take a picture, then send to teachers, so they can show it. Uh, with everyone, okay. Okay. Then this is the other uh, demonstration from an uh, English teacher. Okay. This teacher also use the uh, Kahoot. They have some IRS. So students have to uh, input their answer.
Okay, let's uh, let's English class. So let's use the iPad to recall the conversation between your buddy, the two students. Then then later there's recordings then send to the, the teachers. Then teacher can share their conversation. So that's this time the student will practice English conversation, then they will recall their conversation. Okay, there, there's some teacher, other teachers will, because this, this is a, a open teaching. So, so there are some English teacher are, uh, just uh, look at it, the student's activity. Okay, then, okay, this, all the students, they just recall their conversation, then the teachers can share with each group's uh, conversation. Okay, so share with all the classes. Okay, so uh, actually, this is quite easy for the teachers to, to, to hear students' uh, conversation. Yeah, the teacher can select one of the students the, the assignment, then to share with the student. Okay, uh, at the end of this class, the, the, the teacher asked student to finish the final test. Okay, after finish the test, they can return the, the tablet. Okay, so now student has to do to, to the quiz. Uh, okay. Then, okay, this the, the last one. Uh, I put in a, a, a question mark because these teachers, this in high school, uh, physical education teacher, they teach uh, badminton, uh, but they use tablet. So I, I don't know if this. So you play. Remington and use tablet. First, the, the teacher show the, the video. Uh, then the student, we, uh, every two students in a group, so they can recall their uh, Playing and to see if the, they can correct their uh, some action. Yeah. Okay, and this is so probably I, I wonder if students playing. This this one or they will done to improve their uh, skill. Okay, so I'll come back to <laughs> okay.
Okay, so you can see the uh, sub activity here. Okay, there's some teacher use the tablet in classroom. Then later I will show you some popular um, uh, platform. Then uh, this one is a self-learning uh, system, uh, which this is um, maintained by the Ministry of Education. So they are all, maybe I can show you here. Okay, this is the okay. This is the system that's here. This um, student just log in. They are diff all kind of uh, examination, but in addition to to take the test, there are some uh, videos so we can show how to solve the problem. So students can, for example, this is an example of math. So there are some solutions. So students can just take the examination by themselves. Just learn, just self-learning. So it's all free. Then also the teacher can just assign some examination to students that they encourage students to work with the parents. So the parents can can help uh, the children to learn the mathematics. So it's a their QR code, so they can uh, log in and some invite the parent to to work with the uh, yeah this tablet. They, they log in this system, so they as the parent can work with the children to do the uh, some examination. Uh, Okay, that's from okay. Oh, oh, oh. Did, I, did I show you the the platform? Okay, then I'll, I'll show another one is uh Okay, and this website is actually is initially supported by the foundation. Then later the government just support this uh, website. This code, this include everything from uh, mathematics, uh, from natural science, uh, Mandarin English, computer science, and all kind of. Uh, they have a lot. Of, uh, show you okay so I just let me show you one of the this one it's all free for the students or teachers everyone can use it so actually all of this kind of okay, let me show you this here. there's a different topic okay okay so they have many uh, animations for example
Okay, so this time is no more than ten thousand uh, clips or animations. So it's arranged uh, according to the textbook. So students can learn by themselves. They can watch this kind of animation to learn the science concept. Okay. So let's, let's talk about the web and the, the okay, then the, the best for, Yes, so there's some test about the the about the, the the web. Okay, so uh, this uh, website they have provides many many uh, e learning uh, animation and movies uh, for students to learn by themselves. Okay, so uh, this is a bit uh, project still. Uh, updating so as some new learning material okay um okay the next one i will introduce one of the apps okay let's call it actually there are many apps so it's teachers and and students can use a lot. So like Kahoo, this use so for core IRS that many teachers use right away in, in probably in in a, a teaching uh, activity. So there's a classroom some management. So there's a reward system for each student. If you behave, behave well or if you uh, volunteer to answer questions or uh, then they see get, get some positive points. Uh, so there's, there's some reward system. So they, or, otherwise there's some uh, game-based quiz. Uh, teachers can use the existing, existing some uh, quiz, some words, but in, just just uh, take it quickly to translate into some game-based quiz. So you, it's more fun, so students can uh, to answer the quiz, like play game. So actually there's some the three most common use, commonly used apps. So now I'm going to show you the Kahoo. Kahoo, actually this software is original developed by India, uh, but they provide the basic version which is very freely used. Okay, I'm going to um, show you the Kahoo. Okay, uh, this is Kahoo. So I have, uh, actually I have created uh, one of the, the quiz okay so now i i can pretty easily to uh make up a examination the, the quiz okay so okay right now i'm going to modify one of the, this is the the question then this is the answer so probably then i can change I'll be like to. Okay, so I changed the the question. So the answer will be here. Okay. Then I'm set. So, okay, I can continue to to modify or some to add question. So now we are going to uh, I'm going to host. We're going to have it um, after I finish. I can have the 
uh, quiz now. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to uh, please take your phone to join this quiz. So the teacher, okay, please use your phone. Um, you can use this QR code. Please use your take your phone and camera. Dear colleagues, please try if you want. Hmm? Okay, I ask students to try if possible. <laughs> okay, I can see how many students are in this quiz. Okay, so I can. Okay, so okay, so one oh. here, two. <laughs> so the teacher will know right away. Okay. The three. Okay, okay. All right, okay. So probably we, we, we can start now. So I can start the quiz. Okay, this is the, the question one. So uh, you have to, Seven, five, fifteen seconds, twenty seconds to. Okay, you have one answer. Seven seconds. Okay, then we got the, yeah, these students be back. Okay, then I can know right away. So I ask, actually, I can know who's wrong, who's who's right. Okay, so go to the next one. So, okay, this, you can see the, the feedback, you get the correct point. Okay, you can see the result right away. So, this, then the, we have try another one. So controversial question. <laughs> okay, so how we not check or, or, or. <laughs> okay? Okay, we can see. Okay, oh, we have three, three kind of answer. So okay, so uh, this one the person has has go. Okay. Okay, so I can see the students uh, feedback right away. So we we going to have the uh, probably one more, then that's that's it. Okay, so probably you can. Okay, two, three. Okay. Uh, oh, the price but quite good. So, okay, then everyone got it on. Okay, then also, you can put some pictures here. Oh, you, you can decide how many seconds you can put. Let's do this because I see that. I think it's quite easy. So everyone has, you can wait. All right, okay. So everyone is correct. Okay, so so let's see. Okay, all right. So you can see uh, that's quite easy for uh, for teacher to have designed uh, uh, this kind of quiz. Then student can. And so right away, so actually it's, it's really common to use in, yeah, in, in classroom, okay. Okay, so uh, uh, yeah, you can see some, uh, a bit of time, you can see some commonly used apps, okay. 
So probably in the end, I'll discuss the pros and cons here. Uh, there's some advantage to use the, the tablet in the classroom. First, they increase students' technology skills. So every student has to learn how to use the tablet to learn to follow a teacher's instruction to learn or, or they can take it take it home to learn by himself. Okay. Um, the other one is motivate adaptive self-learning. So like there's a platform called Adaptive Learning System uh, by the Ministry of Education. So it's free to use. So they, they, the contents is from uh, elementary school to high school. So if students can learn faster and better than their peers, they can probably for every school student can learn the content of the secondary school if she or she's learning learn very fast okay so this uh, they can adapt it uh, self-learning so then can enhance students participation so with the uh, tablets students can dis discuss the question they can work together to the uh, um, worksheet so actually they can take a picture or record this conversation then say it to the teachers so the teacher can uh, share student work with all the class class uh, mates so that's that's quite a, a good way they can share uh, their work and assignment and the next one um, the for many for men, particularly for the rural area, uh, so many uh, schools encourage students to borrow the tablet home, so they students can take the, the tablet home to work with the assignment with the parents. Okay, so there's another way to extend the, the use at home. Okay, then. But there are also some disadvantage. So I can see um, actually there are some uh, negative feedback from the teachers and parents. So uh, yeah, there are still pro some problems. Okay. So first, the teacher workload and skills demanded. Okay. In fact, increased uh, teachers workload. Although not every teachers. Uh, it's required to teach with the hand tablet. So far, that means that the Ministry of Education encourage teachers to teach, but not, not mandatory. Okay, but I think it's the trend. So the the teacher have to learn how to teach in the in the future. So actually, they need some skills in computers and in, in classroom management. So. Um, the second one, I can see they use a lot of like like Kahoo system. So they have a lot of activity that uh, let students to take the quiz or do some examination. So we some people are questioning that okay, the teaching become test oriented, always test, always test, some quiz test in the classroom. Uh, actually, this kind of, it seems encouraged to have some quick answer. Um, the student has no time to uh, think longer some probably uh, more difficult question. Oh, so I mean, there's it's this kind of instruction will encourage the short answer than quick response. But, but in education, we still encourage uh, students can think and discuss some really sophistic sophisticated questions. Then the other one is some students uh, uh, become really addictive. Okay. Then some parents worry about students health problem because you watch the, uh, the tablet all the time. So that will be harmful for their eyesight. And the next one is not for every person or every course. 
uh, some students prefer to learn in fast fast um, so to learn uh, by discussion that's not prefer to, to learn with machine with computers and also there are some courses not necessary to use the tablet uh, for example the physical education but um, some teachers still try to design some uh, unique way to to integrate the tablet with their teachings so but uh, sometimes we are wondering if, if this is necessary okay so then comes up to the conclusion so that's some of my my personal opinions so uh this first one here uh actually teachers are the crucial part okay um if a teachers can well prepare then they can design the good uh, uh activity so they can integrate technology well but still there are still some teachers uh, are not good at technology so if you force them to uh, use this tablet before they are ready then the classroom will become a disaster i saw many uh, classroom teaching that is uh, that's not good. that's good the teacher can teach uh, very well in traditional way but if you ask the teacher to teach with the tablet without any preparation um that can be a the cat a disaster for 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 the the teachers and for the students okay the second one is not all teaching the learning activity need technology okay uh occasionally you can add some one class with technology now for example some physical education some arts so you still need some a uh, real uh, has some experience okay so the, the, the last one sharing is important because this area is, is quite new so most teachers don't know how to uh, integrate tablet with their teaching so the, actually this uh, ministry of education is, uh, is encouraging some uh, competition or demonstration so it they encourage teacher with some innovative uh, lesson plans. Uh, they can get some money or some rewards if she or he share uh, the lesson plan. So they, then there will be very good and some uh, open teaching. Those two other uh, colleagues can watch their teaching. Also, the, the government still uh, adding some uh, free e-learning resource online. So there are more and more some animation, a movie that students can, can watch and learn. Okay, so some, I mean, this, uh, this, what so far we have found now. Okay, then that's it. That's my uh, presentation. Uh, any question? Thank you. Uh, thanks, Guo Hung, a lot for your uh, experience, for sharing uh, this initiative in, in about Ivan. Uh, it's really nice, uh, despite where time is limited, and, and as usual, because it's running quite fast and it's our biggest enemy in such a case. Uh, students, please, if you have some questions, we can. Uh, can take some more minutes and uh, if, if you have some questions to ask Professor Wang. Got it. Possible in Italian language also, no problem. I will try to translate somehow. Uh, I think we just want to say thank you because it was very interesting to listening about Ivan and about this program. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I like to share uh, the chairs and Yes. I okay. want to say thank you as well, and I've got a question about the arts. How do you measure the arts, the results? What do they do on the tablet? Okay, okay. So, um, 
as far as I as have seen, um, there's a teacher education to, to painting or to, to some artwork. Then they use the tablet to uh, take a picture um, or to recall the, the process. Then they upload to the website so the, the teachers can share. Then there's a, also a, a evaluation system so online so students can to score each other for example they can vote oh this is the best uh, work or this the, the so they encourages the peer to evaluate their their, their peer students the work all right mm -hmm. and as well i was really surprised about the physical education because myself uh, my profession is a physical education teacher and mm -hmm. i at the moment i don't really understand <laughs> how can they educate themselves you know i mean in terms of physical education you know like uh, exercises and stuff theoretically i guess it's very it's going very well but I mean, in their shape, in the body, in the, the you know, physical shape. How how does it look? Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, actually, I don't quite agree with the physical education's uh, integrate with with the tablet. But in it, but for some part, of, okay. For example, the uh, the teacher will. Sh uh, encourage students to to watch the video from the players. There actually there are some some basic uh, uh, movies online. Uh, they sh they demonstrate the basic uh, practice of the some movement. Okay, so students can learn from the 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 movies uh, produced from the Ministry of Education. So, but later they have to yeah yeah to to practice yeah. So they main part of the physical education you have to it your your practice your, your body okay then then you can see this this uh, on the video you can see that, that this teacher they ask students to recall their peer students uh playing uh but actually unless the the teacher can correct students uh, movement otherwise it's I mean, it's, it, it doesn't help too much, okay? Yeah, because theoretically, it all seems very well, perfect. But I mean, in practical, yeah. Yeah. It, it shouldn't yeah, go yeah. that yeah. way. Yeah, that's, that's, pro that's a, that, uh, the problem in Taiwan. So actually, personally, I don't quite agree with this initiative <laughs> because um, the government spends so much money uh, to buy the equipment, but not all the teachers are capable of uh, integrated tablet. Some teachers are good, but actually, we are know it's not political. Okay, you can see the open teaching, they will want to share, but just one, one class or two classes, but majority of the teachers are not ready or not willing to integrate the Mm. Yeah, this, te this technology that consider their their traditional teaching is better. Okay, so I I I, but I, I think it has some effects. But mm -hmm. after you spend so much money on this initiative, probably five years later, so what? So if you don't no more no budget, probably the tablet become old. So probably ten more years the the old. Can, yeah. can cannot be used, but teachers still don't change much. So I think the teachers are the most important part of this initiative. So yeah, unless there they are really some kind of uh, course that's really useful, so it's very practical, then I think they, they will be worth it. Otherwise, I don't actually, we, we, my personal opinion is this is to probably it cannot ask all the teachers to to do it. Yeah, to join this project. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Okay, uh, thanks, Wang. And just to, to remind that last year during visit in Taiwan, we had an opportunity uh, to visit Lantan Elementary School and we mm -hmm. observed some physical lesson or training uh, in special room, including technologies. It was really nice. Uh, no more questions, I think. Okay, time is is, is over, and uh, thanks once again, Huang, and we will meet approximately in one hour. Please be ready to go to our Cognition Lyceum, and uh, we will visit our school in countryside, and <laughs> I hope it will be possible to compare and to, 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 have, to have some short discussions.